Okay, we're talking to two hot women right here for the Blue Star Moms. <laughs> Tell me about Blue Star Moms. How did this all begin and, and what are you doing today? Well, Blue Star Moms are mothers who, who have children in the military past um, and presently serving. And we are a support group for each other and for the families and then we support the troops also. Today we are doing care packet, Christmas care packages to the troops. Um, our goal is to do 400 boxes today. 400 boxes. 400 boxes. Now, where do you get all the stuff that's that's in that room? Through the community. We um, do food drives with Sam's Club and Walmart. Walmart. We did a poker run, um, which was for Christmas presents for the troops, and we have drop-off spots. So. Now, how, what's it cost to send a box over to Afghanistan? 11.95. 11.95, no matter how much it weighs, right? No matter how much it weighs. Um, so, I think we're going to be spending close to five thousand dollars on postage. Now, where does the money come from to pay for that? The community. Really? Donations? Mm -hmm. And the AV Fair. We work at the AV Fair for 10 days yeah, or 11 days. It's our biggest fundraiser. Yeah, AV you guys raise a lot of money there, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. A lot of good gift givers. Well, we're going to go in the room where we're going to like check out and see some of the stuff that the Marines will get. Now, you do two type boxes. You do hygiene and you do food, right? Mm -hmm. So, the, do they actually request? Because you have an actual name for these people, right? Yes, we have actual names. They're mostly um, names from the local area, the local community. And um, we ask the guys what they need or the girls what they need and they let us know and so we try to gear the boxes towards what they need. And how often do you do this per year? Three times a year. Three times a year. So they're, they're going to get these right before uh, Thanksgiving, right? Hopefully. It yeah. depends on the mail, you know. Yeah. So, I mean, Sometimes the deadline... Sometimes a little after yeah. that, but... So the post office tells us, you know, it'll allow six weeks before Christmas okay. to get these out. All right, we're going to go inside now and see the boxes. So um, thanks very much, and thank, thank you. you for doing what you do. And thank, thank you. you. Yep, let's go in and see the room here. <laughs> well, I brought you. Dad. Okay, here's the, the room just filled full of stuff. Now, this is all the food type. You get coffee donated by uh, one of the local companies here, the Newhall Coffee Company. You've got uh, like chicken salad, it's like little crackers. Uh, you got Rice Krispies, pudding, Cheez-Its. You got Pop-Tarts, look at that, Pop-Tarts. Power Bars. Oh, and here's one of my favorites right here. Okay, Girl Scout cookies, donated by the Girl Scouts. Of course, Famous Amos. And then this is the hygiene part here. This is the soaps, the toothpaste. They get all this. This will be in their package, whatever they request. Hand sanitizer, check that out. Deodorant. They even got DVDs, okay? Batteries, you name it. All these Blue Star Moms here are all dedicated to help it out. There's all the boxes stacked up. They'll be making those today. Here's the Christmas cards they get. Now, how do you get those Christmas cards? Oh, those are made by kids all over the valley. Um, okay. We have some the whole classrooms that make them as um, a project. Yep. Sometimes we just have individuals who bring cards to us. We have several moms who sit around buying cards and make cards, and that's how we get the cards. And then people that's bring them to us, and we put them, make sure they get in the box. Excellent. And they get socks. They get socks. So there you have it. That is. Howard Kassis here at the Blue Star Moms. I'm coming from Lancaster, California. I'm Barry White. Thanks for tuning in to YouTube, and thank God for Blue Star Moms.